do you need this back? Um, I've been uh, working on a um, clock divider module, which is um, very useful in uh, sound synthesis because when you divide a uh, clock frequency, you can get some sub, sub octaves, and uh, that's pretty cool. Um, let me show you. We turn our on our oscillator here, and um, we have our ranges, as I've shown you. An LFO range and uh, mid range, and uh, the the high range. Last time I told you that I thought it was too high, but um, now I know why I thought of it, because uh, then we can divide this very high frequency and still um, be able to listen to it. So uh, we plug it into our. This is this is the one we are talking about here. It has an input from an oscillator. Any output uh, in uh, this, uh, the synthesizer can go here. And um, the output has gone through this rotary switch, which selects one of the twelve outputs from the forty forty chip. And uh, it's divided by a factor of two, so it's the clock frequency is divided by two, four, eight, sixteen, and all the way up to four, four thousand and ninety-six. So that's quite a high division in the end. I plug it into my mixer down here. Um, last time this this didn't work, so now I want to show you that it works. Um, We uh, we choose a division here, and there's hole through. The um, the range is set as high here, so it's in the highest spectrum of the audible uh, frequency. We divide it. When I switch down here, the it gets louder because it's uh, our ears want to listen to it as louder. sort of a mid-range. It's useful for generating clocks from something you would listen to as an audio signal. You can divide it down to becoming an LFO. Let's show you here. You can hear some of the original signal is bleeding through, which I find quite funny. And uh, the circuit is very simple. Um, I had a little trouble with um, this. is also going to be a divider, um, but.
but with all the stages and output for all the stages. I wanted to make it as one entire board, but I had a little bit of trouble, so I thought I'd just uh, make a single divider here. Do you think I can use? Um, this is the board right here. So it's uh, it's quite simple in structure. I'll put up uh, schematics for it.